Hi, hello, I'm Elemental Owlet. You can call me Ellie, and today we're going to be streaming by ourselves, and we're going to be playing Stardew Valley. And today we're going to go to the Egg Festival, I, the Egg Festival, I believe, but for now I'm going to test out my audio, just make sure a lot of things are working, and then we'll get started at 12 p.m. EST, so about three minutes. Alright, I'll wait for someone to join first. Alright, I did a few audio checks. I'm pretty sure everyone can hear me. And is the music too loud? Oh, my mic volume is pretty loud? Okay. Okay, how about now? Does it sound better? Okay. Alright, I think I fixed the Stardew audio. Is it good now? I lowered it by like 30 or 40-ish percent. Alright, so voice and stream music good? Hey Vesper, hey Quig, and thank you Starzy. Alright, one more minute and then we'll get started. Oh god, I almost forgot to switch to my live screen, but it's okay. Quig, what the heck? Growls, barks, vores your ankles. Love that, okay. And as soon as we hop in, we basically have to go to that egg festival, and then we have to beat Abigail because she eats rocks, and honestly I'd do that too, but there can only be one person who wants to eat rocks, so it's fair. Alright, it's 12. Live screen now. And I'll go to the right profile this time. Alright, can you guys see everything? Because I, I don't have two monitors, so yeah. Let me see. It says you can, so. I'm gonna switch to performance mode so it goes slightly faster. Alright, now we're ready. Loading in. Ellie, day 13 of spring, year one, Barkborn Farm. All right, here we are. Let's water our crops first because we have to wait till 9 a.m. Beans. And hopefully we can buy the strawberry seed packets from Pierre at the festival. Because I don't think you can get them anywhere else. All right, we got like 70 crops or something. So this is going to take a while, but that's okay because we need time or we need to kill time. And also, hopefully, um, the other three of my stream party will wake up so they can join the chat too. And Vi and Ferrix are going to be streaming at 4 to 5 p.m. EST, and then Azrak's going to do her stream at 8 p.m. EST if you want to tune in then. And if you have questions about, like, what they're going to be streaming, just, you know, drop a question and I'll answer it. Great, right, perfect. About one hour until the egg festival. I wonder if I can harvest my grass right now. Or rice, I meant. <laughs> Let me go get my scythe. Nope, wrong chest. Here we go. Nope, not yet. 
refill the watering can and let's go. Gonna check for dandelions and daffodils. Okay, there's one. Ooh, a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna return this to the chests at home. Daffodil and a leek. Perfect. Yep, yep, leaks for George. I love him. And um, his wife, Evelyn. Alright, the egg festival started, so let's get going. We gotta talk to everyone first, too, to get those friendship points. Alright, Pierre, give me them strawberry seeds. Okay. I can buy five. I'll buy the full five, because I don't know when I'm gonna get these again. So now I have 96, and I don't need to buy anything else. Colorful set. Pastel banner. This would have been nice, but maybe next year. Decorative pitchfork. Amazing. Alright, Shane. Our hens have been working overtime to prepare for this festival. They deserve the best night. Bowls full of sweet yellow corn. That's so sweet of him. <laughs> no one really talks to me. I just came for the deviled eggs. Yikes. I love Linus, but, you know, no one likes him because he's homeless, I guess. Is there any more food? I mean, seems like there's plenty to me. <laughs> I put something nice into the punch. Oh, so she spiked it! Yay! <laughs> Egg? What a strange thing to eat. Yeah, okay, Demetrius. I mean, Starzy, can you blame me? She, she drinks alcohol, like, all the time. And then she's just saying, oh, I put something into the punch, yeah. Spring is a busy time of year, so it's nice to have a day off to catch up with friends. I agree. Abby has always loved the egg hunt ever since she was a tiny girl. I will have to crush her dreams today. Even with my bad leg, I never miss a town festival. That's good. <laughs> Eggs definitely have a place in the well-balanced diet. Yep, yep. Alright, George. What's everyone so happy about? Hmm. Eggs. Why eggs? I don't know, man. This festival has been a tradition for as long as I can remember. Traditions connect us with both the past and the future. It's comforting. Alright, fisherman boy. Uh, Willie, I think? Yeah. Sometimes I'll hide an egg too well and no one finds it. Well, until summer rolls around, then the hot air starts to bring out the rotten smell. <laughs> I mean, at least that's a good thing that you can find it afterwards, I guess? Do you think everyone's ready for the egg hunt yet? Nope, not yet. Marnie. Welcome to the egg festival. Compliments of my wonderful brood of hens. So it's sponsored by Marnie. We love that for her. Thank you. <clears throat> Vincent loves this festival. It's a joy to see him so happy. I've been up since dawn coloring eggs. It's always my favorite part of the season. I love that they all come together and help with an end, just not on Marnie. Mmm, this fruit punch is unusually good. Yeah, Leia, it's because you like wine and sh it's probably spiked, but, you know, don't let the kids drink it, I guess. Elliot, taking breaks from work can make you more productive in the long run. Yep, that's why you should take breaks while you're studying or doing schoolwork in general. Or any work. I hope I can find some eggs before Vincent takes them all. When does the egg hunt start? I'm so excited. Soon, my child. The children have been looking forward to this festival for weeks. I always look forward to these gatherings. It makes the valley feel like a real community. Okay, too many people. If I missed some, it's fine. We'll start it. <clears throat> Actually, let me stand down here, because I think it starts as like soon as you talk to him. <sighs> yes, let's start. Alright. I think we need to get like 10 eggs to be Abigail. Oh, okay, there's a cutscene, yeah. It's time for the highlight of today's festivities, the annual spring egg hunt. Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. Now, is everyone ready? Yep, yep, give me them eggs. 
Let's egg hunt begin. Okay, run. Gotta find them eggs. All right, there's one by this bush. Perfect. Steal them from Elliot. All right, I think there's a couple up here. One by the trash can. One by this tree. I remember that there's one by Lewis's truck. I'll snab that. I don't even know what snab means, but it's okay. I'm stressed and I want to win the egg hunt, so shush. One down here. Seven. Another one, eight. <clears throat> There's gotta be something by these houses. Okay, one there. Nine. I think nine's good enough, but please give me ten. I wanna find another egg. There's one right there. What the heck? Why is there a rock? <laughs> okay, I have ten. No, I was gonna get eleven, but it's okay. Odd numbers are better, so. Wow, look at all these eggs. Now if only I could get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, we'd have this we'd have the cleanest town the side of the gem sea, chuckle. And now, the winner of this year's egg hunt, I swear to god, Abigail. Yay, it's me, Ellie! Take that, you frickin' dragon. Here's your prize, enjoy. Wow, a straw hat. <laughs> Thanks. It's cause I'm a farmer, isn't it? Well, that's it for this year's egg festival. Thanks for coming, everyone. All right, and now it's nighttime. And before we go to sleep, I'm gonna chop some trees just because I don't wanna waste all of this energy that I have. <clears throat> And I gotta clear out for the coop that I wanna get. And the silo, but the coop comes first. Also, I'm gonna turn up my screen brightness. Yeah, that should be better. Oh god. I don't know if that changed anything on stream visually, but it helps me. Alright, I gotta put these seeds away, and I'll put on the straw hat. Look at me. Straw hat, overalls, brown pants, we got the whole fit. <clears throat> oh, nothing changed? Well, that's that's unfortunate. I hope it's not too dark then. Gotta perish all of these trees, and then I'll head to bed. <clears throat> I think this should be the last one. Oh no, I lost all the wood in the water. Alright, yep, that's the last one. Let's go. Gather this wood, put it in the chest, and we'll be fine. Alright, perfect. 64 wood and 4 pine cones. Wrong chest. Are these chests even colored? No, they're not. Green chest. Dark green and light green. Because green is my favorite color. Alright, time to head to bed. Yes, peak farmer aesthetic. Also, look at my dog! He's so cute! I love how you get to choose him on the player screen. Alright, and his name's Briar, by the way. <clears throat> Alright, let's go. Let's water our plants. Hopefully we have some beans for the bundle. Nope, not yet, but we'll have them eventually, so it's fine. Nothing to worry about. And we got a heck ton of cauliflower. Also, I can't tell if I watered that one. Okay, got it. What are your guys' favorite seasons? I was just thinking because I love the spring in at least Stardew because the cherry blossom petals. But I'm very fond of like autumn or spring. I 
I love spring personally because it's like not super blazing hot like summer and then I got to plant all of my plants and watch them grow throughout the spring and then into summer when everything starts to burn. <laughs> All right, we're almost done. Yeah, Vesper, that's basically the same reason that I also really like Autumn. Let me pause so I can read. Autumn, not too hot or cold, and the leaves are pretty colors. Yep, yep. Especially um, Japanese maple leaves, they get a really pretty red. I mean, technically they do that throughout the year, but I feel like it's more prominent during um, the autumn season. All right, let's see. Gotta take this geo to Clint. And anything else? Wait, are these summer crops? Oh, okay. All right, the strawberries are spring crops and we have a couple of days so we can plant them right here. Um, let's see. We'll just make a row here. One, two, <clears throat> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Alright, gotta get rid of this because it looks funky. Not the most. For some reason, I thought I had eight strawberries. Whatever, it's fine. Don't pay attention to me. Alright, time to water them. Alright, now time to give Clint this geode. And then we'll like fish or mine for money. Probably fish. Also, welcome to the chat, Vank. what he's doing. I've been mayor of Pelican Town for almost 20 years and maybe you should retire because Robin would be better but that's beyond me right now. I mean she does all the construction and probably plans some of the or most of the events. I feel like she's the kind of person to do that. Whoops. All right process geodes. Here you go. Give me something good. Five copper you know that's not really that good but I'll take it. It's useful. Functionality over prettiness. All right, let's go to the mountain lake. Love fishing there. Ooh, daffodil. Um, I'm gonna go home and get the materials for a chest because I'm definitely gonna need it with all the fish I'm gonna catch. And so I can store the rest of the stuff I got. Definitely need to save up for that first backpack upgrade, which I think is like 2,000, 2,500 or something. Great. Alright, perfect. And I gotta get the wood, of course. Crafting, here's the chest. Alright, now off to the mountain lake. Oh, and my dog running in the corner. He probably wants to go, but it's fine. He'll be fine. I wish you could take him places in the town. I think that'd be cool. Oh, Haley, no time to talk to her though. Gotta fish. Gotta get that coin. And I'll place it on some generic island so the NPCs don't run it over, because I've heard if they walk through them, they actually destroy everything in their path. It's kind of suckish. I think this island should work. Yeah, I'll just I'll just put it here. No one ever walks over here that I know of. We'll have to find out. 
Oh, and Linus is over there. Maybe I'll give him a fish. And for some reason, a lot of people don't like fishing in Stardew Valley, but I like it. Maybe some people just find it a little difficult. Oh, Sebastian goes over to this island? How about the one to the right, like over here? Frick Sebastian, I love him, but don't break my chest, it's got my fishies. Well, it will have my fishies. Okay, bet. Ah oh, yes, more algae. Perfect. Mmm, driftwood. Alright, I guess I'm not getting any fish today. Alright, never mind. Okay, maybe I'll go for the chest. Yeah, I'll go for the chest. Okay, never mind. Maybe I shouldn't have one for the chest. <laughs> Got too greedy. Maybe when my fishing level is higher, I'll do that, because I'm pretty sure the bar gets bigger. <sighs> that was lame. Alright, cool. What do we get? Bullhead! New record! I want there to be another chest so I can get both the chest and the fish and redeem myself. Hmm, <laughs> algae. Well, actually the algae isn't too bad. I can just eat it to regain energy. So. Alright, another fish. Let's go. Give me a chest, please. Nope, but I got a perfect capture, so that's something. And a carp! New record, 28 inches. Good. Give me all the fish. Ooh, and a gold star, because I got a perfect catch. Alright, another bullhead. I'm gonna fish over here. <laughs> Soggy newspaper. Fantastic. Don't switch your fishing spots. Always fish in the same spot. What the heck? Otherwise you'll get trash. Oh yeah, the bubbles to my right? Yeah, I'll go to those. After this. Alright. Give us a good fish. Give us a big fish. <gasps> Large bass? Yeah, I'll take that. Alright, I'm gonna store these away. Eat this algae. Oh, 13 energy. That's not great, but not bad. <clears throat> All right, and I, I think I'll leave the chest here. I don't know if Sebastian goes directly towards this tree, and if he does, I'll just cry. It's fine. Um, I think that should be enough. Yep, perfect. So it's like three to four bars on the fishing meter. All right. Oh wow, it just stayed at the bottom the whole time. You know, that's good enough for me. And 29 inches. <laughs> algae. It's fine, the algae will prolong our fishing trip. I missed, let me reel it in. Perfect. Shoot, almost a perfect catch, but it's okay. Oops. I'm guessing this is another carp since it's not even moving. You know, there's a chest. It's not moving. I will get the chest. I'm gonna get the chest. 
Never mind, I'm not getting the chest. <laughs> Stupid carp. Alright. I'm gonna get it to like almost full, right? And then we're gonna go for the chest. It's fine, we're gonna get the chest. And the fish. We're gonna get the fish. You know, it's fine. <laughs> Perfect. Now give me some good treasure. A <laughs> single geode. I hope that's a good geode, but he already closes at like 4 p.m. Uh, the Clint dude, so we're not gonna do that today at least. And I'm running out of energy, but I do have a piece, two, two pieces of algae now. Also, which fish do you guys think Linus would like? I have like bullhead, carp, and the largemouth bass. Whichever one you pick, I'll give him because. He deserves a present, and I like him so. Alright, 30 energy. That's about 15 more throws, I think. What fishy vibe does Linus give you? Alright. <clears throat> Large mouth bass. Okay, I'll put these away. He's neutral on all fish. Well, yeah, but what vibe does he give you? Bullhead? Carp? Or largemouth bass? I think he's a carp kind of dude. I'll give him a carp when I see him again. Oh, bullhead? Okay, bet. I'll give him a bullhead. Let me just catch these few fish. I guess a carp is very basic. Maybe that's why I thought it was his vibe. Uh, that sounded really rude. I didn't mean because he was basic. I mean because everyone likes carp. <laughs> and if you don't like carp, that's fine. Some people just don't like fish. Another treasure box, I'm going for it. Alright, perfect. See, look at me, I'm such a good fisherman. Pro Stardew Valley player? Yes, please. <clears throat> Alright, I think that's enough fishing. Two chubs. Oh, oh yeah, and the treasure. Frozen geode? Okay, cool. And three pieces of wood. I'm excited for the geodes. And I'll give him a... What was it? Bullhead? Yeah. Okay. Put that one away. This one. Great. Oh, and Sebastian- please don't. Oh, okay, he's going down. Good. Good. Alright. Bullhead. A relative of the catfish that eats a variety of foods off the bottom of- uh, off the lake bottom. Okay, good to know. He do be having whiskers. Are you in here? <gasps> he is. Okay. A gift? How nice. Yeah, you're welcome. Stream picked it out for you. You should be their friends. And I got a leak. All right, now I gotta take the fish home in trips. So how am I gonna do this? I'm gonna probably put away the trash and the wood in the chest because it's not that important. All right, trash, wood, driftwood's also technically trash, but Leia likes this, so I'll give it to her. Um, fish, 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 fish. Oh, and to save some space, we might actually go donate it to the, what's it called? The community center. Yeah, that. Because I think we need largemouth bass, bullhead, and carp. I'm not sure about chub. Heck. Ah yes, walk directly into a wall. My favorite pastime. Alright, to the aquarium. <coughs> Blue Junimo. Alright, we were at the lake, so this one. Alright. Largemouth bass, carp, bullhead, and what is this? Sturgeon. Yeah, I don't think you can catch sturgeons in the spring. So we'll leave that alone for now. But we got three out of four, that's really good. Alright, time to get out the rest of our fishies. And then sell them on the black market for money. Oh, 
Wrong place. Okay, I'm gonna talk to Sebastian. Hey, your name is Ellie, right? Yep, that's me. Please don't destroy my chest. I will be sad and have to break your knees. Even though I really like Sebastian. Alright, time to go home. Gonna take the back route, because there might be more forged goods that we can pick up, even if our inventory is full. You know, maybe there's another leak. Alright, it's only 10 p.m. Nope, no more foraged goods. But that's okay, we got plenty of fish. Oh, and maybe we can smelt that copper that we got earlier. Okay, let me put all the fish away. Great, two gold star carps, a chub, another chub. Largemouth bass, bullhead, and we'll save the leak for George. And the geodes for tomorrow. And I'm gonna give a daffodil to Evelyn. Because why give someone a present if you're not gonna get their partner a present? Like, what the heck? Especially if they live in the same house. Anyways, smelting that copper ore that I was talking about, if I can find it. Here we go. Perfect. Oh, and we have a bunch of copper. Okay, cool. I think I can sell these parsnips too. Let's sell some of this stuff. Crabs? I, I really don't think I'll be needing crabs. And I know I'll need a morel for the, uh, what's it called? The community center. All right. Everything else looks good. All right, crabs, parsnips. And now we're good. Time to go to bed. Gonna pet my dog first. Nice. He's so cute. Alright, nice. Okay, level up. Level 2 fishing. Plus 1 fishing rod proficiency. So hopefully the bar gets bigger. New crafting recipe. Bait. Okay, I, ha I hope I have bug flesh for that. And we got a bunch of money. 735 gold. Alright. So now we need 1,300 for our backpack. So we'll be there soon. Just a couple more days of fishing and or mining and then we'll be good. Okay, mail. Hello dear, I know you're just getting started as a gardener. So I wanted to give you a little tip. Most crops you grow in one, s you only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your spring crops will, die will all die out. So plan ahead, Granny Evelyn. See, wow, she was thinking about me and now I'm gonna give her a gift. Thank you for the advice. Gonna mail you a gift right now. Hand deliver it, actually. <gasps> and the berries are ready. Okay, cool. I'm gonna steal all these berries and then water my crops. Daff, da or dandelion, yeah. More berries. And my dog. Good. It's blocked my way. It's okay. Alright, we got berries, flowers, and now we're gonna water our crops. Gotta get my watering can, of course. Okay, perfect. And all of these parsnips are ready. Okay, let me put stuff away. Great. The geodes, because they won't stack, so I'll know where they are. And we're hoping for two gold star parsnips, because we need two more for the community center. Please. I grew so many parsnips. Okay, so this one's a gold star because it won't let me pick it up. And I have a silver and a regular one, so. I think we'll keep the silver star parsnips. Actually, no, we have plenty of parsnips. We're gonna sell all these. <clears throat> yeah, we're fine. Uh, I'll leave one, two, three. Yeah, okay. That seems fair. We only got one gold star. I guess we have to go get more seeds. That's unfortunate, but we'll make it work. Yep, four gold stars. All right. Now we gotta water everything. I think we'll get like 25 parsnip seeds. 
because I don't want to grow all of them only for me to need the one gold star. I think that's fair. And so I don't have to water the rest of my plot because that's quite a bit. Quite a bit of work. And the the rice looks ready. It looks all big. Yeah, okay, cool. I'll get my scythe soon. Add water. I like the rice because it waters itself by being near the pond, unlike any other crop that I know of. Alright. Strawberries, can't forget about them. Oh, I already watered them. Cool. Alright, scythe. Give me some rice. Alright, four unmilled rice. Perfect, I'll put that away. Put away the scythe, um, the rice, and then we'll get our geodes. Alright, so we'll give our presents away first, then go to the community center, and then finally end with going to Mr. Clint for the geodes to be broken. Oh shoot, and we need to buy seeds. Okay. Gifts first. Pierre, community center, then Clint. Yeah, hopefully I'll remember that. If not, it's whatever. Take this leak, good sir. I know they're your favorites. This is my favorite thing, thank you. Yep, I knew that. Daffodils, I think she likes them. Oh my, it looks wonderful. That's very kind of you, and thank you for your advice, you know? It all works out. I don't have anything for the grandson, but that's fine. We'll just run away. Let's check the calendar. Anyone's birthday? Oh, <laughs> maybe I should have talked to Haley consider or yesterday because it was her birthday. It's fine. She's pretty mean. So, shop time. Okay. 10 and we need like 15 more. I think I can shift click to buy five. Yep. Okay, cool. 25 parsnips. We better get one gold star out of these. Great, we're done here. I'll talk to these people because they're here. Marnie. I love animals, Mr. Ellie. If you treat yours well, I'm sure we'll become good friends. Yep, I'm aiming to get a coop. It's like 2,000 gold. I'm getting some supplies for the saloon. Pierre's got the good stuff. Yep, he's got the vegetables from me, for the most part. Alright, community center. Gotta drop off this morale. Unless I already did it. Actually, I can just check, right? Is this the foraging one? Nope, it's not. Crafts room. Exotic foraging. Morale. Okay, so I haven't dropped it off. Good. Bush. What are these? Salmon berries? Amazing. I think this is the right room. Yep, crafts room. Wrong one. Exotic foraging. Morel. And then we can get pine tar, oak resin, and maple syrup once we can tap trees. Oh, and I have a cave carrot at home. Okay, I'll have to go back and get that after I crack open the geodes because the dude closes relatively early. I think 4 p.m. Alright, here we are. Give us something good. We'll start with the worst geode first and then the frozen one. Alright. <laughs> More copper. Okay. And like a geode thing. Esperite. You know, that sounds like Vesper. I'm gonna put you in my museum, Vesper. Let's see. Yeah, Esperite. 
I'm locking you away. Donate to museum. Um, can I put you? Oh, I can't put- I'll put you by the diamonds. You're valuable. Alright, and you gave me a new reward, so I'm glad I locked you away. That sounds really not great, but it's fine. Okay, standing geode and starfruit seeds. Cool. We got two people here. Starfruit seeds for Starzy and Esperite for Vesper. Alright, I'll take the standing geode too. Can be placed as decoration. Cool. And these are a summer plant, the starfruits. Alright. Gotta return home, plant these seeds, and then get that cave carrot for the unique, or what was it called? It was one of the foraging bundles, I know that. I'll check it. The exotic foraging bundle. Yep. And more berries. Harvey. We sell a few over-the-counter medicines at the clinic. Feel free to stop by if you're feeling exhausted. I know that being a farmer is pretty tiring work. Don't overdo it. Yep, of course. I'll watch myself. Just for you, Harvey. More berries. Berries and then planting parsnips. And freaking daffodil. Perfect. Another one. Alright, I'm glad I went up here. I wasn't going to, but... Oh, I can't even pick it up. Okay, that's fine. I'll return for you, Daffodil. Alright. I wonder if I can make fertilizer yet. Let's see. Crafting recipes. Oh, I can. Okay, I just need to use sap. Alright, I'll get that started. Put away this stuff first, and then I'm gonna go place my standing geode. Right, cool. Hmm. It, it'll be a centerpiece, yeah, I'll just... Perfect. Okay, gotta water these in. And then I'll get the fertilizer. I'm pretty sure I have plenty of sap, considering I've chopped a bunch of trees down. So that shouldn't be too hard. And I wonder if I can put on the cauliflower, but it might be too late because they've sprouted, so... I'll just get a bunch of fertilizer. 65, that's about 32-ish. Yeah. I'll just use it all. Wait, shift click. Yep, cool. 32, I was right. Perfect. Yep, it's too late for the sprouted ones. But seeds, fear not, for we will have golden parsnips, hopefully. Alright, a bit too much, but we have some for the later season. Alright, wrong chest. Oh, and we already have basic retaining soil. This soil has a chance of staying watered overnight. Mix into tilled soil. Okay. Put this away. I'll give someone a flower if I see them, or we can smelt that. Oh yeah, and we have to give our cave carrot to the community center. Let me grab that. Amethyst for Abigail, and a quartz for Sebastian if we see him. What other gifts can we give away? We already gave a leak away. We'll give someone a potato, why not? They better appreciate my gifts. Alright, time to go. And I did not forget about that daffodil up there. Mine. Okay, that makes sense why I wasn't able to pick it up. It was a golden star. Alright. Let's find Abigail. 
give someone a flower and someone else a potato and then hopefully we'll run into Sebastian. Okay, Caroline, you're getting this flower. Oh goodness, are you sure? Yup, just a wildflower. We'll give you this flower. This is a really nice gift, thank you. All right, now we hunt Abigail. Hopefully she's not in her room because I don't think I have enough friendship. Yeah, okay. Maybe she's in the kitchen, who knows? Nope. All right, hopefully we'll run into her eventually. Maybe we'll give Pierre a potato. Oh, there she is. Okay, cool. I seriously love this. You're the best, Ellie. You're welcome. I mean, it makes sense. Your hair is purple. Have a potato. That's very kind of you. I like this. Good. I'm glad everyone's liking their gifts. Quartz for Sebastian and cave carrot for the community center. And then we'll end the day with fishing. Any flowers up here? Nope. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Oh, why did I go to the fish tank? I don't know. Go to the foraging room. There we go. Yeah, okay. So if we get maple syrup, oak resin, and pine tar, we'll be able to fill it up. Yep, three slots. Alright, now to fish. And perfect, it's like 6pm. I think Sebastian comes out of his room at like 7pm. But I'll check anyways. Another flower. Mine. Also, hi, Fair, because I see that you're in the chat now. Thank you for coming. Alright, is he in his room? Maybe he's in the kitchen. Nope, he's here. I'll wait till 7 p.m. and see if he comes out. If he doesn't, I'm just gonna go fish. Come on, Sebastian, don't let me down. I got quartz for ya. <laughs> I done been lurking. Yeah, I just realized that you were here. All right, he's not coming out, what the heck. I'll have to give him the quartz another day. But for now we fish. Actually, maybe maybe he'll like a flower. Maru helps me out in the lab, sometimes she's a good kid. Everyone likes flowers, what the heck. Why not? That was very thoughtful of you. I'm glad you think so. Time to fish. And maybe Sebastian will even join me out by the lake like he did um, yesterday. So we can look forward to that. A horseradish. Okay, cool. I'll put it in the chest for now, just so I can fish freely. And I don't see any bubbles, but that's okay. We'll work with it. Alright, it's already 8 p.m. Alright, a fish. Oh, this one's kind of fast. Alright. A chub. Cool, okay. Another chub. I guess chubs are just the late night, the late night fishies. Also, I do see bubbles to the left in the very bottom corner. I'll go get those soon. Green algae. Yep, time to move to the bubbles. Hopefully, yeah, I can hit that. Okay, cool. All right, green algae. Green algae. Yep. And I'm guessing this is a carp because it's staying at the bottom. Yep, I was right.
more algae. You know, it's fine, we'll use that for the next fishing trip. But I think tomorrow is a mining day because we've been doing a lot of fishing. Okay, fish. Another carp, probably. Yep. I'm so glad for the bubbles because they make everything go so much faster. And hopefully we'll reach our goal of 2,000 for that backpack so we can have a bunch of space and not have to run to home every single second. Bullhead. Okay, inventory is getting kind of full. I'll put the algae in here. Green algae. Getting kind of late, 10.30 p.m. All right, I think we should start heading home at 12 p.m. Or technically 12 a.m., I guess. Trash. Yeah, we'll just throw the trash right back in the trash. Okay, a couple of more fish and then we'll head out. Alright, this will be the last fish. Nice, and we're ending it on a perfect capture note. Alright, a carp, cool. Algae can go in the chest, and I'll take my salmon berries back home. Alright, let's go. And more berries. in our copper bar. Let's put that in the chest. We have plenty of copper. And let's see if there's anything else we should sell because I really want that 2,000. Great. Bug steak. I don't, I don't think any of them want that, but a morale, we can sell that. And we can sell some of these parsnips. Okay. And I think there will be more berries in the season, so I'll sell these salmon berries. Parsnips and a morale. Time to sleep at 1 a.m. Oh, the doggo, he likes the geode. Let me pet him. Oh, okay. Or not. Never mind, I'll just go to bed. Time to leave the dog alone. Oh, and weird howling noises. 
Level up. Level 3 farming. Plus 1 watering can proficiency and hoe proficiency. New crafting recipes. Bee house, speed grow, and farmer's lunch. Okay, cool. Level 2 foraging. New cooking recipes. Survival burger. Alright, we made a bunch of money. Okay, cool. Yay, we have 2,000. Let's go buy that backpack. After we water our crops, of course. I am so ready to have a bunch of storage space. Alright. Okay, cool. Our beans are ready, and we got mail. But I wonder what that howling at night was. I've got some new items in stock. A deluxe fishing pole and some bait that you can attach to it. You can use bait to make fish bite faster. Hope to see you soon. Willie. Okay. Yeah, I didn't even check if I had bug flesh. I'll check that later. Dear Ellie, how are you doing, sweetie? I've missed you so much since you left. I hope the farming life is everything you hoped for. Love, Mom. P.S. I sent your favorite cookies. Aw, she's so sweet. We love an in-game mom. Alright, any more mail? Yep, more mail. Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I am writing to let you know that Pierce store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? Pierre. No, thank you. I made my own. DIY fertilizer. Alright, another letter. Okay. Dear Farmer Ellie, I'd like to apologize for joking about your grandpa's old cottage when we first met. It's really a nice little house. However, you might need some more space someday. That's where I can help. If you bring me some raw materials and pay a fee, I can expand your house. Continued on the next page. The first expansion I offer includes a kitchen. With a kitchen, you'll be able to cook any recipes you've learned. Anyway, I hope you're starting to feel at home in Stardew Valley. Your local carpenter, Robin. See, she's so much sweeter than Lewis, and she's actually doing things for the community. What the heck? Make her the mayor. But I got beans to pick, so... Hey. And the strawberries are growing nicely. <clears throat> And these parsnips better give me a gold star. Otherwise I'm going to have to wait until spring to complete the quality crops bundle. And that would suck a lot. At least we have the backpack to look forward to. Alright, last row, then we can go. Alright, oh and we can sell some of these green beans. I'll only sell a couple. Oh, and do we need gold stars? Um, I don't think we need gold star beans, so I'll just keep two. And look at my dog, he's running around into a bush. Alright, wrong thing. There we go. And let's get our pickaxe so we can mine. And our sword. Alright. Do we have any food? We have our bug steaks. I'll take that to the mines. And a cherry bomb. Okay, I think we're good to go. flowers. Nope, but there's more berries. Oh, and worms. Do I have my hoe? Yeah, I do. Okay. Always bring your hoe with you. Never know when you're gonna see worms. Alright, gotta get that backpack. 
Glad it's not a Wednesday. Whose birthday is it? Anyone's? Nope. But Pam's is coming up. And it looks like there's a quest to do. Clint is, ne is in need of a daffodil. Okay. I'll get him one, hopefully. Oh, event time. Or cutscene. <laughs> Give me the backpack. Welcome to Pierre's. How can I help you? The backpack, please. Oh, who's walking in? Oh, weird Jojo... Jojo Corporation dude. Morris, ahem. I hate his weird hair swoopty thing. Looks so weird on him. Come and get it, folks. Coupons for 50% off your purchase at Jojo Mart. Get out of here. Well, any takers? Well, I can't blame them for the deals, but he's a trashy person. I guess Pierre isn't much better, but still, he's more local, I suppose. But I can't match those prices. I'd be selling at a loss. Kick him in the shins. It must be so difficult for you to lose your loyal customers like that. But can you blame them? Joja Corporation is clearly the superior choice. Ugh, look at his weird smug face. Why is he giving me a kitty face? Disgusting. Get out. Soon the whole town will realize that. We need to get a restraining order. Don't let him come in here. Especially if he's just going to be rude like that. Alright, it's fine. I'll give you 2,000 gold for the backpack. Now you're rich. 24 slots. Nice. You got the large pack. Your inventory space has increased to 24. Perfect. Alright, now let's go mine. For more money. Gotta get us that coop and that silo. Oh, shoot, and the daffodil for Clint. Um, hopefully I'll run into one. I can just give it to him tomorrow, I suppose. More berries. Alright. No daffodils so far, but I think we have some in the chest at home, so. And I'm gonna give Linus berries, because he likes berries. This is a great gift, thank you. Yep, yep. Gotta share the forged goods. Alright. Floor 20. Sounds an awful lot like 420, but no thank you. Alright, gotta kill these bug boys. And then we'll get bait. Or stuff for bait. Yep, bug flesh. Thank you. Oh god. Weird cocoons. I hate that. Please no. Oh god. And a diglet thing. Oh, and more bugs. Okay, fun. Isn't this just fancy? It's fine, they're all dead, except for this one. Okay, perfect. Alright, now we just gotta kill this uh, mole thing. Oh, and the crab. Okay, cool, I got another cherry bomb. Now it's your turn to perish. Nice. Mr. Krabs. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I do have more inventory space. I'll put this in the back. Bug meat, slime, and rice shoot. A way down has appeared. Yep. Well, I guess I can just use my sword as a sickle. I I'm a fool. I forgot my pickaxe. <laughs> I hate it here. Uh, I guess I'm going back up. Maybe I should have went home and given Clint his daffodil, so I would have been prepared for this situation to occur. <sighs> Walk of shame home. It's fine, it's only 1pm, it's not that late. Not yet. 
any clothes at four. I guess I better hurry. All right, who needs who needs a sickle when you got a sword? All right, where's my pickaxe and that daffodil? Gotta give my man's a daffodil. All right, cool. Got my pickaxe in hand and my daffodil. Okay. We made it. Just 210. He's not closing anytime soon. And let me sure or let me make sure it's him. Yeah, Clint. Okay, cool. Here you go, bud. Hey, is that the daffodil I requested? It looks perfect. You're welcome. Let's see. Here's what I owe you. Yep, 90 gold. All right. Now time to go mine with an actual freaking pickaxe. Because who would go into the mines without a pickaxe? Certainly couldn't be me. And then there's a daffodil right up here. Okay, that's nice. I guess I got a refund on my daffodil. And there's one up there, what the heck? All right, I'm taking it. It's mine now. And we just hit the one hour mark, so yay! One more hour and then I'll end stream at 2 p.m. EST. Alright, let's try to get to floor 30. Oh no, not the infested floor again. Oh no. All these bugs. You know what? Maybe we'll get more bugs than we did last time. It's fine. Okay, it's not fine. They're cocooning. Pain. wonder if you have to deal with this every time you go to floor 21, because I'm never coming back. I want the squirts, though. Going down. And I got a pickaxe this time. More bugs? Come on. What the heck? I much prefer the blue bugs, because you can stab them once and they'll, then they'll die. Alright. I'll prove my point here. Come here. Perfect. And a geode, cool. A rainbow one at that. Nice, and a way down. I'm gonna explore the floor a bit and then use that. Oh, this is quartz. Copper. Alright. Alright, let's kill them before they become cocoons. Yes, nice. And this crab. All right, and a slime, I think? Yep. And then we'll run. Back down that ladder. All right, cool. We're almost to floor 25. More bugs, of course. Perish. Maybe if we kill everything on this floor, we'll just get a ladder. Hoping for that, because that's one of the easiest ways to get a ladder. Alright, two more bugs. We, we can do this. Alright, no ladder. Okay. That's fine, I have, I have cherry bombs. We'll just use those. Yeah. Alright. Oh, 
Oh, hi Azarak. I'm glad that you're here even if you are half awake. Alright, I'm gonna chop this grass. Bonk. And one more floor until 25. Ew, more bugs. And another bug. Perish. Good. Ooh, it gave me a rice shoot. Okay, cool. I can grow more rice when I get back home. I'm just gonna go down. Yep. Alright, we made it to tw floor 25. Sadly, we're out of cherry bombs. Okay, let me read what you said, Azrak. I stayed up till 5 a.m. because someone woke up and told me to go to bed at 4 a.m. randomly. Yikes. That's weird. <gasps> Yay, ladder. Okay, maybe we can make it to floor 30 after all. Aw, oh, not more bugs. Kill him first. Always gotta kill him first. Back up, you slime. Okay, another floor. Um, I'll kill this bug and then I'll go down. Nope, not another bug. Nope, I'm running. <gasps> another floor. Okay, we're just speed running this whole thing, aren't we? Love that. Yeah, the flying bugs are the worst. Especially when you have like... Oh, I guess I don't have the beginning weapon. But when you have the beginning weapon, oh gods, it is so much worse. Um, slime. Back the heck up. <gasps> Yay, it gave me a ladder. Okay, you know, no hard feel- Yeah, I'm not- I'm not going over there, I hate that. Why is there four bugs? No thank you. Perish. Okay, we just need to find one more ladder. So many bugs. Shoot. Okay, I definitely need to eat some of the algae or something. I'll eat a bug steak. They give plenty of energy and health. Alright, fight me. You buffoon. Nice. Alright, now let's find that ladder. Oh, oh, ew, gross. For some reason I thought that these were mushrooms. I don't... Stupid bugs. I don't like you. Get out. Come on, just one more ladder. Why are there so many bugs? This game hates me. They gave me all the ladders in exchange for all of these bugs. I guess it's just the law of equivalent exchange. Oh, what? Monster Slayer goal. Complete. See Gil for a reward. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna break these crates and then I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna get the heck out of here. <gasps> Rubber boots? Are those better? One immunity. No, they're not. They're going in the trash. Anyways. A geode. Cool. And sap. I'll eat the algae so I can get the sap for more fertilizer. Yeah, sounds good. Yep, I am going home, so don't worry about that. After I go down. And yep, time to go. Hopefully I can make it home before 2am, because otherwise you collapse. And then you have to pay a lot of money, so yeah. Not looking forward to that if that happens. Gotta run. But we got a we got plenty of geodes, so at least we can bring those to Clint. And then we can raise enough money, hopefully, for the coop. And then tomorrow I'll plant those grass shoots or rice shoots that we got. Alright. Oh, trees are blocking my way. What the heck? Right, is there anything I should sell? I'll sell the crab. Why not? Alright, crab. 
I think that's it. But I'm gonna fix my inventory a little. Grass, daffodils, berries. Oh, and we can smelt these while we sleep. Bunch of copper. Perfect. I'll keep this in my inventory so we can smelt another one as soon as we wake up. Monster drops, clay, mixed scenes. I'll keep the quartz on me. Algae, you can go. Sap and wood. Okay. I think we're good. Okay, cool. <laughs> and my dog's in my bed. Okay, cool. At least I can still go to sleep. When you have the cat, I don't think you can actually go to sleep when the cat's on your bed. Because I had a cat um, on my solo profile. Hi, spawn cat. Also, I'm just refer referring to what Azrax said in chat, by the way. Go to sleep for the night? Yep. And just in time, it was 1.50 a.m. <laughs> okay, cool. 490 gold. I think we're about halfway there for the, the coop. Uh, yeah, almost to a thousand. <gasps> and it's raining! So that means we should go fishing, because yes. <gasps> is the cauliflower ready or is it just big? <gasps> no, it's ready. Okay, cool. So we got cauliflower and beans that we need to shove into the community center. And then I think we'll get a gift from that, because I think those are the two crops that I need. Let me check. Pantry. Yeah, spring crops. Green bean and cauliflower. I was right. And I'm gonna eat these nasty bug steaks to get my energy up. Um, how much does it give me? 45? Yeah, that'll be perfect. And I have cookies as a snack. Let me smelt this. Rice shoots and what else? You don't need two cauliflower. Okay. Perfect. Three spots for array shoots. Alright, let's go fish. Uh, I'm gonna check for flowers and everything else up here though, first. Kinda trying to stall until like 9am so I can go see Clint. Also, can I even go over here? I think you can. Maybe there will be more bushes or something. <gasps> there are! Berries! You know... If I don't get flowers, I'm fine with sa salmon berries. Oh yeah, spooky tunnel. Okay, I can't go further, but I see a panel, so I'm gonna talk to it. It's a battery-powered lockbox. Unfortunately, there's no battery in it. Oh, okay. Maybe that opens up the gate. Alright, almost 9am, so I'll head on over to Clint's. Azarax says who you romance in, if you are. Sebastian, of course, he's great, he's fantastic, and he has nice hair. Geode times, we got five geodes. Alright, give me the goods, Clint, it's raining. I ran to your shop in the rain, you better give me something good. Oh, almost went the wrong way. Not to Lewis, to Clint. And hopefully I get um, things I can donate so I can get more rewards. Alright, gonna break up the worst geodes first, and then the rainbow one. We got a pride month geode, look at us. Calcite? Looks pretty. Um, mudstone I think? Yeah, mudstone, okay. Coal. Okay, so we've gotten pretty good things so far. And stone. It, it just got worse from there. Alright, the geode. The LGBTQ plus geode. 
he got clay. That was somehow worse. Alright, so much for doing, you know, saving the best for last. Guess that's not a thing anymore, but it's okay. We can donate the calcite at least. Um, donate to museum. Because I do believe we have mudstone. Let me, let me check. Yeah, it's right down there. Anyways, calcite time. Oh, and somehow I don't have a quartz in here? Um, okay, sure. Why not? Okay. No rewards, but that's okay, because it's time to fish. I forgot my fishing rod, what the heck? Time to go back home, I guess. That's fine. I'll go by Marnie's house and see if there are any flowers that I can forage, and then it won't be a waste of a trip. Oh, and there are berries, so it's already not- it's already not a waste of a trip. Alright. Any flowers? Oh, but there's more berries. Oh, I do see a dandelion. And I'll clear this grass so things will grow, hopefully. Alright, perfect. Oh, and a frog! And that's another thing, Sebastian's really cute when he looks for frogs in the rain, like what the heck? And it's like the only other time he goes out besides um, when the sun is down. Most of the time anyways. Alright, <gasps> another frog! He should come to the forest and look for frogs. Why is he looking at the beach? Actually, that really doesn't make sense to me. I don't know of any saltwater frogs. So maybe someone someone should let him know. You know, I'll tell him when I see him. He's looking in the wrong places. Alright, berries. Alright, you know, I'm glad I forgot my fishing rod. I just got all these goods. Alright, putting the mudstone away. Um, dandelion. Oh shoot, I need to give... The cauliflower and green bean to the community center. So I'll put this away. This, this, and I'll save this for Sebastian. Fiber, I won't need fiber, so. Grab that fishing rod. And gonna get this copper bar because I can't. Alright, where should we fish? The river, lake, or the ocean? I think the river will be our best bet, if but if you say something else, I'll 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 go do that. Alright, but Yeah, I'm gonna go fish by Pam's place, the little trailer thingy. We're on the bridge. I really like the bridge. It's simple but pretty. Of course, I put all of my tools away. Also, look at- he's- there's the man! The frog dude! I'm gonna follow him first. I want to see where he goes. I swear he goes to the beach to look for frogs. And it's like, bestie. I don't know if you know, but- but frogs aren't at the beach. Not most of the time, I don't think. Kid. Alright. I'll wait for him to get to his destination and then I'll talk to him about it. Be like, hey, I, I don't know if you know this, but you're not going to find frogs over here. Also, I'm really bothered by the fact that I put away my hoe. Even though I said earlier in stream, never put away your hoe because you never know when you're going to find worms. But it's fine. Um, Sir. Alright, I guess he's going all the way to this pier. This is wasting a bunch of time, yes, but I need to know. The ocean is best enjoyed alone, don't you think? Oh, maybe I should leave you alone, sir. It, he's just gonna keep repeating that. Okay, I get the message, Sebastian. I'll leave you. But I swear, every time when it's raining in the spring and he comes over here, he talks to me about frogs. But I guess he just doesn't like me enough to talk about his frogs. I get it. I see how it is. I'm going to the bridge. Not this bridge. The other bridge. All 
Alright. The river. Give me some good fish. Ah, oh, shoot. I should have given him the quartz, but it's fine. I'm mad at him. Not talking to me about his frogs. His amphibian friends. Smallmouth bass. Nice. And I still gotta give these to the community center. Okay, I believe we need a shad, so hopefully we can catch one of those. I know we know need a catfish and like a sunfish, so. But one of them is one of the fishes that you can only catch when it's raining. Shoot, another smallmouth bass. We got time though, it's okay. Chest. Okay, I'm gonna get the chest. And the fish. Perfect. <gasps> a shad! Okay, cool, that's exactly what I needed. And I just got a fossil? We got a frog fossil! Amphibian fossil. Artifact. Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to the museum. You know, uh, let's go do that. <laughs> Maybe we should show it to Sebastian. You know, this is what a real frog looks like. A dead one. A fossilized one. That is funny, but also unfortunate. He doesn't want my frog fossil? What the heck, man? Oh my god. Oh my god, I X'd out of the thing instead of getting the treasure. I actually hate it here. You know what, whatever, I'm going to the community center and then I'll continue fishing. I guess I was just distraught at the fact that this game was giving me a dead frog fossil, you know. That's nice. <laughs> I hate it here. But it's fine, I'm gonna complete a community center bundle, that'll make me feel ten times better. And yeah, I don't want your dead frog anyways. Alright. Ooh, I can also give the shad away. And it'll give me an opportunity to check. Riverfish, where are you at? Here we go. Yep, a shad. Catfish, sunfish. Okay, I was right about that. And tiger trout. Cool. So much for that treasure. Wait, is this the wrong one? Yeah, it is. It's the foraging bundles. And this is the crop bundle crops. Gotta put it in- oh. Never mind, we don't have to put it in order. Usually I do, but I didn't have them at the time, so. Just forget about it. 20 speed growth. Stimulates leaf production. Guaranteed to increase growth rate by at least 10%. Mix into tilled soil. Okay, cool. And a green Junimo. Oh, okay. Pan away from the green Junimo, I guess. But they're my favorite. And we got a new golden scroll. Oh god, Azurek, that emoji is strange. Uh, octopus squid thing. I I'm okay. <gasps> we got some mushrooms in here. That's cute. Okay, what do we got? Adventurer's bundle. Slime, bat wing, solar essence, void essence. And you need two of those, okay. Ooh, okay, quartz, but... Quartz, Earth Crystal, I have one of these. Frozen Tear, Fire Quartz. And what's this? Blacksmith Bundle. Alright, I got Copper, of course. Iron Bar, Gold Bar. Okay, so this seems really easy to complete, actually. And there's only three of them, so we'll work on this later. But let's catch some fish. Because once I get the sufficient funds to buy or to make a coop, then I'll get the materials to make the coop. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. 
Maybe we can even get more treasure chests. I love that when they give us the little treasure chests. Okay, not for this one. But I did get a perfect capture, so good on me. And another shad. Gold star, in fact. There he is! Stop fishing, I'm giving you the quartz. I would have showed you the froggy fossil, but uh, we don't talk about it. Thanks, I like this. You're welcome. Now maybe you should do me a favor and talk about frogs next time. What am I going to do today? Um, I don't know. Probably nothing. Wow, we love an adventurous life. Thanks for that. I swear he's better sometimes. Alright, more fish. No men, just fish. Also, welcome to the chat, blood bloodluster. Another fish. Alright. What the heck? Okay. Ooh, this is a new one, I think. Bream? Don't recall seeing any of those recently. Ooh, and a silver star. Gonna make me a lot of money. Alright. Good. Alright, hopefully we get a catfish or a sunfish. Maybe they just don't come out when it's raining. Oh shoot, and it's 8pm. Heck. Soggy newspaper. Okay. Another shad. That's fine. Maybe I'll fish tomorrow in the river. I think that's a good idea. If it's not raining. If it's raining, I'll go to the lake. Also, 30 minutes left of the stream. Just FYI. Another fish. Smallmouth bass. Okay, let's fish on this side. Maybe we'll get something else. Another shad. Okay, we'll catch like one more fish and then head home. Alright, this is the last fish. And a treasure chest. Okay, I'll get the treasure chest. Please, I want I want both the fish and the treasure. Thank you. Good. It would be kind of cool if they gave me a fossil again. I swear I won't throw it away this time. Uh, they gave me bait. Can I even put bait on the bamboo pole? No, no I can't. <laughs> okay. That sucks. I'm going home though. Oh shoot, was it someone's birthday today? Okay, tomorrow is Pam's birthday. Um, I'll, I'll give her parsnips. I think she likes parsnips. I don't know, parsnips are cool. Alright, time to sell all these fish. Wait, 
I want to check the aquarium. I have a feeling I might need a bream. Let's see. Um, okay, lake, night. Yeah, okay, so I do need a bream. Okay, glad I didn't sell it. And I already gave away a shad, right? Yeah, okay, cool. So keep the bream, sell the shad, and the smallmouth ones. Yep. Keep the bream. An oyster? I think I might need that for one of the bundles, the crab pot. Oh, I already gave away an oyster. Okay, I can sell the oyster too. Good for me, and then I'll get all my tools back, hopefully. Great. And I don't need the bait until I get a new rod. So let's see. Axe, pickaxe, hoe, watering can, and then scythe and sword. Oh. Scythe, sword, fertilizer can stay in there. I'll take the cookies and I'll take the berries. Great, cool. Oh, and a parsnip for Pam. All right, time to go to bed. All right. Yay, we're getting all these fishing um, levels. Okay, level up. Level three fishing. Plus one fishing rod proficiency. New crafting recipes. Crab pot and dish of the sea. All right, I definitely need a crab pot. So let's look at that tomorrow. Or today, I guess. And day 18 of spring, Pam's birthday. Ooh, and it's raining again. I don't have to water my crops, perfect. Um, let's see. Parsnip for Pam. And these are ready. All these cauliflower, so much money. All right. I guess I should chop some wood because I'm definitely gonna hit my goal of 2000 soon. So I can build that coop. I should probably clear a space, so I'm gonna go do that. Can I even put it on the grassy part? Yeah, I'll put it like right next to my house if I can. I'm glad I went to bed early in the game because I have plenty of energy to spend. All right. Maybe I can just put it over here. Because there is grass right over to the left. Oh god, we're already almost out of energy. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Let me just... Oh, that's fine. Perfect. So either here or maybe up here is where I'm going to put my coop. I'll figure out when I have the materials. And I guess maybe we won't fish today, just because of the fact that my energy is really low. Great. And I guess we can always move it later, so the placement doesn't matter too much. I just need it ASAP. Oh, I did not mean to do that. All right, cool, fixed it. All right, berries, yep. Ooh, more berries, okay. Okay, let's see. How much wood do I have? 124 plus 72. 196. Let, 
196. Um, let me check my book. I have it written down how much I need. Okay, for the coop, oh, I need 4,000 gold, 300 wood, and 100 stone. So I'm good on the stone. I'm almost to 300 wood, and I need 4,000 gold, so I'm 3,000 away from that. So we'll be there soon, hopefully. Definitely gotta chop more trees. Alright. After I chop down three more trees, I'm gonna go to Pam and then finish off my day chopping trees. Oh, I'll eat these cookies. Perfect. Okay. Now we have plenty of energy to chop all these stumps. Alright. Fifty wood? Okay. You know, almost to 300. We need about 60 more pieces. Parsnip sap and pine cones. Oh, I'll put these other seeds away too, and this fiber. Alright. Let's go. So she's either in her trailer or in Joja Mart. Hopefully just in her trailer because it is raining, so. Ooh, and a quest. Oh, I'm in the market for a delicious parsnip. I'll pay you when you bring it, Shane. You know, um, I don't think I have any parsnips, but I'm going to accept it just in case I do have extras. But I really feel like this is the last one aside from the gold stars. So, yeah, Pam comes first. It's her birthday. <gasps> and a prehistoric rib? Amazing. I guess that makes up for the fossil that I lost earlier. Here you go. Oh, is it my birthday today? I guess it is. Thanks. This is nice. Yeah, I didn't forget about you. Even if you did spike the punch at the egg festival. Alright, prehistoric rib. Let's go donate that. And then we'll go home and see if we have more parsnips. Oh, and Penny's standing in the rain again. I'm going to go inside. I just wanted a quiet moment. Then I will leave you alone. Donate to museum. Prehistoric rib. No reward, but that's okay. Now it's time to go back home. And we'll take the longer route. This way. By Leia's house. <gasps> Berries. Okay. Oh, okay, they're playing by the sewer. Ew, it smells. They really shouldn't be out there, it's raining. And you know, maybe don't mess with sewage? Dot dot dot. Why is it locked? I want to explore the sewers. Child, what the heck? I think Gunther has the key. Professor Gunther? The man who runs the museum? Why do you think he has it? I saw a big rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for a big rusty old key. Oh god, slimes. Yeah, don't mess with the sewer, kids. There's something moving around in there. Ah yes, send me to fight it. I mean, I do have a sword. I could take it out. <laughs> or not. I guess I can't get in there, so that's fair. More berries. Perfect. Gotta get the fiber. And I guess I'll chop this wood. Oh. 
sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Keep minimizing it on accident because I keep grabbing the top of my browser thingy. Great. Got all the wood and berries. Alright, maybe I should move up my farm so I can actually clear out the place that I wanted to put the coop. Yep, I'll do that. And we got plenty of grass for our chickens once we get them. Alright, we need to chop down wood. Or chop down trees for wood, because that's what we need the most. I'll eat some berries to restore my energy, and then we'll be fine. Alright, okay. We can definitely take out these trees now. Alright, 60 pieces of wood and we'll be okay. Yeah, we're definitely gonna make it. Yep, 64 wood. Alright, gotta get these stumps and then I'll put it in the chest. So we got enough wood and stone. Now all we now all we need is the funds. And we did sell like 10 or like 11 cauliflower, so we might be there by tomorrow. Who knows? I think this is the last tree I'll chop for now, and then I'll go return the bream to the community center. Oh, forgot the stump. Alright. I think I have enough energy to take it out. Um, gotta watch it. Okay, cool. Just enough wood. Alright, let's go. Oh, I need to get the bream, of course. There we are. Gonna go up here, flowers. Yep, dandelion and berries. Alright, and a leak. Okay, George will get that if I see him. Community center first, though. Daffodil. There we go. Bream in the... What was it? Knife fishing? Yeah. There we go. One of three. Walleye and an eel. Okay. Now we gotta give that leak to George. And then finish up our day clearing out the farm. There he is. Have a leak. This is my favorite thing, thank you. Yep, of course. The air is starting to warm up. I'm feeling pumped, <laughs> he says, standing in the rain.
Alright, definitely need more energy. So we're just gonna eat all these berries. Oh shoot, didn't Shay need a parsnip? Okay. Yeah, hopefully we can run into him. And we do have more parsnips, that's good. So I'm gonna go to Marnie's and if he's not there, then I'll give it to him tomorrow, I guess. That's unfortunate. It's locked. Open 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Uh, I'll give it to him tomorrow then. Down more trees. gotta eat a ton of these berries for them to actually count. Alright, 138 energy. That should be enough. Don't want to chop all this grass, but just some of it. Alright, this is the last tree, and then I'll head to bed. Alright, and tomorrow might be the last day of the stream, because there's nine minutes left. Alright, level up. Level 4 farming. Water can proficiency and hoe proficiency. New crafting recipes include iron fence, preserves jar, and basic retaining soil. Okay, cool. I definitely need the preserves jar ASAP. And I'll look at the crab pot tomorrow, because I kind of forgot about it. All right, we just need 900 more gold to get that coop. Okay. Ooh, and we have a bunch of beans, so we might actually get it. Oh, and the parsnips are ready. Okay, perfect. We'll definitely get the coop next stream. And of course, it'll be on Wednesday as always, and the same time too. All right. Nice, I got four freaking um, gold star parsnips. Now it's time for mail. Hey kid, here's a recipe for a little treat my pappy used to make. Cook it slow. New cooking recipe. Cheese collie. Nice. More mail. Farmer Ellie, I have a request for you. I need fresh cauliflower for a recipe I want to make. Could you bring it? Could you bring me one? Jody. Of course. I got cauliflower in my chest. Alright, gotta sell all of these crops or at least most of them. I'll sell all but one of these parsnips. Okay, and 
these green beans. I'll save a couple, maybe like two. Yeah, sure. So a parsnip for Shane, and then I can put beans in the chest. And where's my cauliflower? Here we go. And Pam wanted that, or was it Jody? Yeah, it was Jody. All right, let's water our crops and then we'll be on our way. Oh, ran out of water. And I hope these cauliflower become bigger um, before spring ends. Because I know we only got like eight or nine days left. And these strawberries. Oh, I already watered these. Okay, cool. Alright, now let's go give our gifts out. Parsnips and cauliflower. And geodes. Oh, and I gotta grab the parsnips for the community center. Can't forget about that. And I saw Morel up here. Nice. Okay, let's go. So a cauliflower for Jody, and then a parsnip for Shane. Oh, okay. Gotta wait a couple of seconds to go in. Alright, perfect. Enjoy your cauliflower. Oh, that looks so delicious. Thank you, this is just what I wanted. It's going to be perfect for my yellow curry. Yep, have fun. Hope you enjoy your meal. Yay, and 350 gold? Yeah, we'll definitely have enough money next stream to build the coop. Oh, and the psyllo, maybe. Alright. Time to find Shane. Probably at the Jojo Mart. Now we gotta find him. There he is. More money. Oh, is that the parsnip I requested? It looks perfect. Yep, fresh from the farm. Technically, even though it was in my chest. Here's a little something for your trouble. One, 105 gold pieces. Cool. Alright. All right, so let's go comb the beach for shells, and then we'll head back and break some more trees and potentially rocks. But I'm gonna check the calendar first just to make sure I haven't missed anyone's birthdays. Okay, tomorrow is Shane's birthday. To the beach. And this is where I'll look at the crab pot recipe. Oh, bunch of seagulls and clams. I'm gonna scare them because I can. Goodbye, my friends. Oh, and Elliot's here. I'll talk to him. The fresh air of this valley is good for body and mind. Yep. A quick stroll outdoors always invigorates me. Me too. And how much wood do we need for this? 300? Yeah, with 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. So I can go get those corals. 
definitely lower on my priority list though. Oh, and gold ores. Nice. Alright. And I'm gonna go talk to Willy and see how much his fishing rod is. I think it's 3,000? Okay, we have the bamboo pole. Training rod is worse. Oh, okay, that's not too bad. 1,800? I'll write that down. Okay, there we go. Alright, time to head back home. Time to take the long way. And if I see Leia, I'll give her some salmon berries. Sam's trying to do a kickflip. Good luck. It's locked. Only Leia's friends can enter uninvited. Okay. That's fair. I wouldn't want strangers um, busting into my house either. Alright, let's store stuff and sell some stuff and then we'll continue clearing everything out. How to sell these shells. Clam, clam. Alright, I think that's all we want to sell. Oh, and we need to bring these to the community center, so I'll go do that. Fiber, seeds, morale, and gold. Yeah. And of course, we'll take a copper bar for the new bundle that we found at the community center. And then after this Stardew Valley day, I will be ending stream. So, yee. A bird. Oh, goodbye. All right, copper bar first. And there we go. Now we only need iron and gold. one. This is the crops. Yep. I need that. Five gold star parsnips. Nice. Now we need melon, pumpkin, and corn. Alright, time to chop trees and hit some rocks. Still have plenty of energy. Let me check. 184. Okay. Yeah, we can get a couple of trees down. Now I'll take out all these rocks. 
after this wood, of course. Ooh, an owl statue. Maybe that was the weird howling. I don't know. I'm not sure how owl statues appear, but I'm glad I have it. Because if you didn't know, I'm Elemental Owlet, and you can call me Ellie. So, perfect. It's just on brand, and I love that. So many rocks. But yes, I am very glad about the owl statue. I will put it in my house. Actually, there might not be enough room and it wouldn't look good. I'll put it next to my house. Yeah. That works. Whoa, and there's a bunch of stuff over here. Okay. The leeks, horseradish, a morel, and a dandelion. Okay, I should come over to this corner of my farm more often. Because that's amazing. Especially for George. Okay. Gonna cut this grass. And this piece of wood. Alright, cool. I think I can cut one more tree down and then I'll head to bed. Uh, maybe not even that. I'll eat a berry. This is the last tree I'll do. Alright, come on, last tree. And I can't forget about the owl statue. Alright, gotta put everything away. Stone, pine cones, seeds, and all this stuff. And I'm gonna go ahead and use all my sap to make a bunch of fertilizer for summer. 67, that's pretty good. And 67 plus 7 is 74. Cool. Alright, and this more owl. Okay, owl statue, I'll put it right by my dog and the furnaces. But look, it's so good. And it's on brand. We love that. Alright, time to go to bed. And then that'll be the end of the stream, so yee. Thank you for sticking around. I hope you enjoyed your stay here. And I'll hope you'll catch um, maybe my other friends' streams that will be happening at 4 to 5 p.m. and 8 p.m. EST. Go to sleep for the night. Yup, and we're gonna get a load of money for our coop that we're gonna get next time. Oh, and a fairy, okay. I think they instantly grow your crops. So, come back next time to see that. I'll wait till the money screen pops up and then I'll, then I'll end stream. Level up, level three foraging. Plus, uh, plus one axe proficiency, new crafting recipe, tapper. So that's how we get sap. And look at all this money we got. 1,285 1, gold pieces. Day 20 of spring, year one. All right, goodbye stream. Thank you for showing up. I'm glad that you stayed here for so long and I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.